It's me wondering why my my protein manager's not replying yeah, to me. Because it just tastes like. She's on live. Actual my proteins live. So you know those lives that I've been doing. She's doing one of them herself. Jack of all trades is my manager. <laughs> hey, what's up, guys? Liam <laughs> here. Welcome back to Alice JTV. We're doing some work on the peninsula. Whilst my uh, breakfast is actually just cooked. It's actually the final part that I have from my previous order of this right here. Flipping out my finger still. Ooh. All the while, I'm doing a bit of tidying, tidying the kitchen, hence why I have the surface spray out and all that kind of stuff. Just like my manager is not the only jack of all trades. Um, we're gonna be going through my current Texas crash diet today, ladies and gentlemen. It's gonna be a good video. Drop a like, comment down below, subscribe if you are new. Thank you all so much for tuning in. Texas is very, very, very close. Three days away when you see this video. It's time. Consistency episode four. Let's go. Good. Does this look? Sausage, beans, like a hash brown type potato thing. It's like 300 calories. Breakfast is full. Right, so. Next job of the day is to have a, oh that's zoomed in, hello. How are we doing people? Hope you're good. That's the wrong way to zoom out. Okay, so next job of the day, shave. Next job of the day, shower. Next job of the day, transfer some files. Next job of the day, actually put away the food that I need to talk about because it arrived like half an hour ago and it's just sat on the side, you know, so not ideal. But first, shower time. Oh my god, you get out of the shower now guys and it is freezing, oh, it's that time of year, oh my days, oh, you don't only want to put the heating on just because you got out of the shower, oh my god. Oh, I forgot as well, the next job is to um, uh, remake my bed, I've currently got just bare duvet that I'm sleeping on, um, just figured I'd let it air out for a day or two you know. And, um, and then put the cover back on. Uh, but that was like three days ago and I haven't done it yet. So, yeah. Also just attempted to shave my chest in the shower and I've come out in a rash. Phenomenal, it just gets better and better. Busy day, busy day. bunch of Christmas decorations under here that I'm not going to get to put up. That's just sad, isn't it? Whoa! 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 Ugh. Never mind putting the heat in, I'm just friggin' changing bed. Oh my god. Okay. Alexa, pause while I show the people my grub. So ladies and gentlemen, this diet, um, I had like two weeks. By the time I actually knew that I, I was going, there was about a two week period in between when I uh, found that out and um, when, uh, when I'm actually going. It's already been a week of that and we've lost like six pounds. Um, it's mad what you can do when you uh, just restrict calories a little bit, up your cardio and all that kind of stuff. Um, and you're in your 20s, it's, uh, it's not too bad, you know. I'm not saying that I'm shredded or anything because well, I'm not, but <laughs> I've lost a few pounds, which, to be honest, is uh, is all I was asking for with um, with, with with this whole two-week little like diet, basically. Like, what's the point in dieting for two weeks? I'm going to keep it going when I'm there because the thing is, when I'm in Texas, I'm going to be surrounded by some of the best bodybuilders in the country, right? Legit. This is this is like a worldwide competition. I'm going on behalf of Team GB, on behalf of the greatest bodybuilders in flipping Britain, mate. It's literally like it's that deep. It's really cool. So inside here we have a variety of meals. Um, we've got pet pots such as the butter chicken pot. Uh, let me move all of this stuff out of the way. Uh, I'll try and get all the prep pots out first. Satay chicken, satay, satay, who's been around for that long. We've got two of them, I think I've got like four of them in here. High protein chicken and chorizo paella. I don't remember ordering that one, maybe that's like a substitute or something. Sausage and bean pot, fajita chicken pot, sausage and bean pot, black bean pot, sausage and bean pot. Satay pot, yes guys, I do in fact say chicken satay, not satay, deal with it. 
Sausage and bean pot, you're sensing the trend here, I know what I like. High protein carbonara chicken pot. Let me give that one a go. And I think that's all of the pots. We've got a couple of breakfast bagels here as well. Let me just, on that note, unstack. The clumsy times are back, ladies and gentlemen. Who misses the times where I used to catch every single clumsy little thing that I did on camera? I know I do to a certain extent. I had a comment about it the other day. We've got some pancakes here as well. There's nothing proteiny about them. It's just pancakes. Um, we've also got a couple of bigger meals in here as well. So this one is a steak and chips. Uh, I believe we've got two of them. This is a roast chicken dinner. I actually had this last week and it was, oh, it was phenomenal. Just a little bit of stuffing, like, basically, with all this roast chicken stuff, you have, like, a, a parsnip in the back and, like, it has gravy, but, like, a good amount of gravy that's not too many calories. It has stuffing, but not too much stuffing, if that makes sense. So it forces you to kind of restrict it. Here's the second steak packet. A slow-cooked pork meal. A couple of high-protein pizzas. Chicken to go with that meal. And two steaks to go with the other steak meals. Fridge snacks, we've got like some pepperoni stuff. These are just like really nice, they're not that bad for you. There's like 100 calories in there. There's booger all in there, there's a few snacks. Basically the way that this works is that you get like three meals in a day, obviously breakfast, lunch and dinner, and a snack in between. All of it adds up to around about 16 to 1800 calories. That is not a lot. I'm aware that that is not a lot. And topping it up with clear whey, maybe other protein snacks, maybe a banana, an apple, stuff like that. Topping it up with good, healthy, high quality nutrition. Sometimes I actually pad these out with a bit of edge. Like if I have a chicken satay pot, sometimes I've actually mixed up some extra, what's it called? Frozen veg and just put it in there as well because it pads the meal out. They're not massive meals. Sometimes I put like the fajita chicken one in a wrap or something like that if I've got some extra carbs instead of having a banana or like, to up the carbs, but from a different source, I will have this in a wrap and then just pads out the meal, you know? Protein, yogurt, vanilla, chocolate, chocolate, and a couple of salted caramel ones. That is everything in that box, ladies and gentlemen. That is everything that is refrigerated as, as well. Also, the snacks uh, come in a separate box. I don't need to show you that. But this, this is it. Thumbnail. This is my high protein, Low calorie diet, right? 16 to 1800 odd calories, but there'll still be about 160 to 180 plus grams of protein every single day, depending on which food that I have. So basically I'll have, let's say, a breakfast bagel for, for breakfast. I'll have just that. In between, I will have a protein bar. I'll have the chicken satay for lunch, and then I'll have a protein bar, and then I'll have my steak dinner for, for dinner, you know, or my chicken dinner, or something like that. That is how the diet works in a nutshell, guys. That's it in, in about, four minutes summed up. Very excited, makes everything very simple. It makes it as easy as possible for me to stick to so that I know exactly what it is that I'm eating. I can say, if I eat this, I will lose weight. It's as simple as that. There's no temptation to have anything else or do anything else. Granted, yeah, I might go on, like have a drink with a mate or something like that. It's a few hundred calories that I need to account for, but I'll just burn that off on the bike the next day, you know? It's not that big of a deal. We get results by doing the basics over and over and over again, and we have a good, balanced, healthy lifestyle on this channel. We're about finding balance somehow, trying to anyway. Not always possible, but that's that. That's the diet, that is the meals that I'm gonna be consuming over the next week for my Texas Crash diet. I need to put all of this in the fridge slash freezer, and then it's on to the next task of the day. <laughs> ever seen in your entire life, but man's in a rush, you get me. Next task of the day is to go and fetch a suitcase from my mum and dad's. They have one, I don't. They live quite far, but hey ho, I suppose I'll have to go and see them whilst I'm at it, you know? So, uh, next task of the day is to go and see my family. I'm gonna take my dad a couple of these Morsia drinks each, because of the flavours each for him. He doesn't know though. Shh. Hopefully he, he, yeah, he'll like them, he'll like them. What do you reckon, Texas? Woo! <laughs> yes! Yes, 
Jesse. Get your muscles out. Yes, Jesse. Not in the camera. Beth, hey, neck, it's cold in here. Oh my god. And with that, ladies and gentlemen, we are bringing episode four to a close. The suitcase has been acquired, video has been filmed, edited, client work for the day done. It is time to chill a little bit. Actually, I have a little bit more to do, but it's just on my phone, I think. Anyway. It is what it is. We're trying to rush to get done before Texas. I need to get ahead with UFB content. It's just, it's all a big fiasco. I'm not going to moan about it. I'm not moaning about it. I don't want to sound like I'm moaning about it, but I've just got a lot to do. And it is what it is. Welcome to the home gym. If you have not yet been here before, this is where this channel was built. I'm pretty sure this is actually the first time that this camera has been in this setup. I could be wrong. Anyway, thank you all so much for watching. That is my crash diet for Texas. Um, only a couple thousand calories, that's all, but it's only for a couple of weeks. It's doing a job, you know. Gonna get a fresh fade tomorrow, and uh, the next video will be packing for Texas. And then by the time you see that video, I'll be in Texas. Mental. Thank you all so much for watching. Like, comment, share, subscribe, and I'll see you all beautiful people in the next one. Say bye, Jesse. Say bye. And she got. I'm a good girl. I'm a good girl. Good girl. Come on in.